Hey guys, welcome back to Honey Money SG and this time is the time to actually introduce to you one of the most beginner friendly apps that you could buy crypto in Singapore and that is actually the Crypto.com app and I do believe that Crypto.com app especially you see so much advertising going on around is one of the most popular apps that you could buy crypto in Singapore because of the user friendliness also the cheap fees as well as the easy onboarding for beginners who are signing up for a crypto exchange account and this is especially true for Singapore residents because you could just easily sign up with your SingPass which is our Singapore residents online government account so in this video let me show you how you could fund your crypto.com app with SGD so that you can save on some fees and allow you to buy crypto in the cheapest manner and to be more precise there are actually three methods that you could use to fund your crypto.com app namely credit card top up bank transfer via Shrix X or X first in the past or wire transfer into the bank account but in this video i just want to focus on the credit card top up because i believe there is actually a big opportunity for you to actually top up sgd without any restriction like the thirty thousand limit that is limiting you in streets x now as you know my channel also has a lot of credit card content credit card saving hacks right so i actually discovered this method from the online community and just want to share with you guys this information so essentially to top up via credit card using the most cost efficient method you'll notice that Crypto.com actually charges you 3.5% on credit card fees which may not be quite good right in terms of cost efficiency because 3.5% I think is better used somewhere else instead of paying credit card fees so in order to do this in the most cost efficient manner I will require you to have three cards the three cards are UOB Absolute Amex credit card Grab Pay Mastercard and the Revolute card. Why do we need the UOB Absolute Amex? And that's because it actually offers you 1.7% unlimited cashback on almost any category that you could spend money on. And this is quite similar to the American True Cashback card, which gives you 1.5% cashback as well. So if you prefer one card over the other, that's fine. You could choose either of them, but I'll go with the UOB Absolute Amex card because it gives like 0.2% more cashback than the Amex True Cashback. And what I need you to do is as usual use this credit card to top up your grab pay mastercard so for those of you who are new to grab grab actually has this prepaid wallet known as grab pay whereby you could top up credits using your credit card and most of the credit cards in singapore actually don't offer you rewards on topping up to prepaid wallets but actually you will be absolute amex and the american express true cashback card will allow you to earn cashback on these top ups so that is actually a very important criteria because Earning 1.7% and 1.5% on this kind of credit card top-ups are actually quite good. So once you have top up your grab pay credits, do also apply for their GrabPay Mastercard within the Grab Super app. And then once you have your GrabPay Mastercard, then you could use this GrabPay Mastercard to go and top up to your Revolut card. Now Revolut card may come in Visa or Master depending on when you apply for them. And why do we need Revolut card? It's because Revolut is actually a prepaid debit card. Whereby if you top up funds into the Revolut card, which you could then spend on merchants which charges foreign currencies such as USD, and they will give you quite a favorable exchange rate without any DCC dynamic currency conversion charges and that is actually quite a big deal because we are talking about DCC charges of around 2 to 3 percent on top of the unfavorable exchange rates offered by other banks if you did not use the Revolut card so then once you have used your GrabPay Mastercard to top up to your Revolut then add your Revolut card into your crypto.com exchange app so that you can buy crypto directly using your Revolut card and most likely if you charge it in USD then you'll get a favorable exchange rate don't charge it in SGD uh. charge it in USD because if you use crypto.com in-house FX conversion then you may suffer a little bit of spread so Revolut spread is actually smaller than that so if all these sound confusing to you let me just summarize it okay you need three cards the UOB absolute Amex card the grab pay mastercard and the Revolut card so you'll use your absolute Amex card top up to your grab pay to earn that 1.7% cashback then use your grab pay to top up to your Revolut which does not earn any rewards and then link your Revolut card into the crypto.com app so that you can buy crypto directly off your Revolut card so all in all you earn like 1.7% cashback with a favorable SGD to USD conversion rate and the good thing about using Revolut card on your crypto.com app is because it is recognized as a debit card instead of a credit card so it will not suffer that 3.5% credit card top up fees which is quite a good deal right so you just save on credit card fees while still earning cash back while we top up 
to your crypto.com app. Yeah, so this was my finding when I was surfing around the online community for crypto.com exchange. And then I hope this knowledge is good use to you. Now we'll move on to the next step, which is buying crypto on the crypto.com app. And one of the good things of using crypto.com is it probably has the best crypto pairs around in the crypto universe, right? We're talking about the most number of pairs. You can buy almost any token or any coin on crypto.com app, which I think even for other competitors like the strong ones, right? They may not have so much offering like some coins they don't offer it on their exchange in terms of the spot rate right they most likely have some kind of alternative like futures instead of just having the coin itself so i think that's where crypto.com come in as a really strong competitor where you can buy almost any coin that is within the crypto universe and the other good point about crypto.com app is that it has zero fees right zero buying fees so you won't incur any kind of commission fees when you go and buy your crypto the other good thing about using crypto.com app is they have this feature called crypto earn or crypto staking i'm sure you heard of it before right whereby you just set aside some of your crypto lock up within their app and then they will pay you back in interest with the same type of coin right so if you stake some of their in-house tokens like cro then you get a little bit of interest back i think it's like every week or every month but i'll cover this in a separate video right this time i just want to talk about funding buying and selling cryptos on the crypto.com app okay let's go on to the last step which is cashing out from the crypto.com app so just now i mentioned that buying will have zero fees right is free but cashing out will have incurred a 0.4% of fee. 0.4% fees, although don't sound like a lot, but compared to other exchange, it may be slightly higher. So that's a bit unfavorable, but I think that's justified because crypto.com don't charge you buying fees. So if they manage to charge a bit of selling fees, I think that's reasonable as well. And if you do want to transfer from your crypto token to your fiat currency, right, you do have to go through the streets X, which is another kind of application within the crypto.com app. So you just have to sign up for a streets X account and and link it to your crypto.com app then all of that will take place and change your crypto token or crypto coin into a fiat currency like sgd or usd so this 0.4 percent fees also apply for transferring out crypto right let's say if you have another platform whereby you want to earn higher interest by staking or lending then it will still incur 0.4 percent fees when you transfer it out so they are really encouraging you to just put all your crypto into crypto.com app by offering you free trades for buying in right because because if you sell it out or you transfer it out, you incur fees, but buying does not incur fees. So try to keep it in there, just stick it or land it within their platform. I believe some of them have good rates as well. And of course, if you have watched this video and really want to start using crypto.com, then I do have a crypto.com referral link in my description below and my pin comment. So do check that out. You'll get $25 worth of CRO tokens if you manage to stick at least 500 SGD worth of CRO tokens. So I hope that you have learned something out of this crypto.com tutorial regarding funding, buying and selling. And do help me click the like button at the bottom and consider subscribing to my channel if you haven't. Also join us over at our Honey Money Telegram group at Honey Money SG. And if you do want to learn more about crypto in a beginner friendly manner, then I recommend you to watch my cryptocurrency playlist right over here because I'll walk through some of the other different exchanges that you could use and maybe some of the other crypto platforms that may interest you with that thank you for watching my name is christopher this is honey money sg steering young adults to financial independence